down. You make kids too. <laughs> kids young and old. All right, I've got a book. We missing somebody? Yeah. Where is it? She's down on the floor. Okay. All right. Well, she wants to come up later. All right. This is a book that I re I read to my grandkids, all four of our grandkids. And they were really young, and they liked it for a long time. I don't know if you are familiar with this book. I know you're familiar with this book. You've seen this book. Have you, have you seen this book before? Yummy, yucky. Have you seen this? It's a good book. The whole series of these books. Yummy, yucky. Let me read you from it is by, thank you, I will give you credit to the author here, <laughs> Leslie Patricelli. There's a whole series of these. Spaghetti is yummy, worms are yucky. Right? Eat worms, we do. Blueberries are yummy, blue crayons, crayons are yucky. That's not fun to eat at all, is it? Soup is yummy. Soap is yucky. Soap, dear. Sandwiches are yummy. Sand is yucky. Mommy's cookies are yummy. Mommy's coffee is yucky. <laughs> Mommy might not think so. Chocolate sauce is yummy. Hot sauce is yucky. Once again, maybe mommy doesn't think so, but we'll see. Apple pie is yummy. Mud pie. <laughs> you eat mud pie? Uh, that's yucky. Burgers are yummy. Boogers are yucky. <laughs> Eggs are yummy. Earwax is yucky. <laughs> Fish sticks are yummy. Fish food is yucky. Put one of the fish food with you. Ice cream is yummy. Too much ice cream is yucky. Once again, maybe some of us would disagree with that. <laughs> That's the end of this book. It has a whole bunch of other things, too. You know, I'm, later on, I'm going to be reading a, reading a story. From, from the Bible that talks about yucky things. This is a, a vision that the Apostle Peter had, and God gave him a vision of the sheep with all these types of yucky things to eat on it. There are things like worms on it, and, and, and bugs, I mean spiders, lizards, and all types of things you know, people wouldn't want to eat. And God was telling him to eat <coughs> those yucky things. But he really wasn't talking about food. Peter found out that out pretty quickly. He, he, God was talking about people. But this was saying that there are no yucky people, right? There might be some yucky food that you don't like. But when it comes to people, no matter who they are, no matter what they look like, no matter where they came from, or anything, God loves them. And he calls us to love all people. All right, let's bow our heads in prayer. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for our yummy and yucky things. Some things we love to eat, some things we don't like to eat. We thank you, Lord, for, our, for people, for all sorts of people around the whole world. And the fact that you love them unconditionally and call us to love them unconditionally. Lord, we pray that you might teach us that truth deep in our hearts. We pray this in Christ's name. Amen. Thanks, kids. <clears throat>